Today we're gonna be checking out 50 scariest TikToks on the internet. And I almost forgot. Girl, you better get that out of here. And you better get to the subscribe button. Like, please just do it now. Click the subscribe button. It'll really help out the channel. It'll really make my day better. And yeah, comment down below what you're gonna be for Halloween. Are you gonna be Iron Man? Or are you gonna be a ghost? Or are you gonna be your mom? Let me know. And let's go. Oh, heck no. You crazy goat? What are you doing in my bedroom at 3 o'clock in the morning? What do you mean, what would you do? Like, bro, if a goat is popping it, like, lock your doors. I bet that ain't a goat no more. That's a sacrifice. That goat gonna be on the grill in a minute. You keep popping in, trying to, what, what do you want? What, what, what do you want? What, you want You want some wood? You want, you want something to eat? You want, like, a, a piece of, you want a piece of meat? I don't know. What do goats eat? Grass? I don't know. Next time you're with one of your friends, you have to play this game. The game is called Cat Scratch. Don't play this game. And you need two people to play. To play the game, you sit down on the floor and your one friend lies on their back with their head in your lap. Next up, start rubbing your friend's temple in a soothing motion as you tell them a scary story about a cat. I'll put it on the screen now, so just screenshot it. <gasps> I'm not gonna Next, after you finish telling the story, the person laying down has to get up quickly and pull up the back of their shirt. On your back will be red claw marks that will be bleeding and are big. But the crazy part is, they won't feel a thing. So if this game sounds intriguing to you, I recommend playing it with one of your friends next time you're with them. No, I ain't playing that dang cat scratch game, are you crazy? Where you get cat scratches on your back, that would be a cat catastrophe. <laughs> Scary photos hidden in picture. Balloon Spider-Man, ugh. Normal photo, okay. I don't see anything. Uh, mm-hmm. I don't know who that is. <gasps> normal family photo. It ain't a normal family photo. There's a black dad in there. <gasps> I'm just kidding. There's two, what, what, who are you? Just random, man. He's just popping up out of nowhere. Ah! Bro, you looking like a referee. Ugh, squiggly diggly jiggly wiggly. No, stop. Like seriously, do you not have a spine? What is that? How do you bend your back like like that, bro? You bending like a flamingo leg. It's very nasty, man. You look like you work at Foot Locker. All these dang contortionists just trying to freak people out. Just because you're double jointed doesn't mean you have to show it off in your TikToks. These twins barely spoke to anyone but each other. As children, their parents quickly noticed that Jennifer and June Gibbons weren't like the other kids. They were unusually inseparable and even created their own language. By their teens, they were even mirroring each other's actions. They would move and walk exactly alike. But even after seeing specialists, no one could figure out what was going on with the girls. One speech therapist noticed that it seemed like June wanted to talk but was controlled by her sister. Their diaries revealed that June felt the same. She called her sister a dark shadow and Jennifer felt that they were fatal enemies. They tried separating the girls but they rapidly declined into a trance-like state. When they reunited, they withdrew even more and stopped talking to their family almost completely. By the time they were 18, they were rebelling and arrested for arson. They were committed to a maximum security prison where they lived for 12 years. In March 1993, the twins were being transferred to a low security, but when they arrived, Jennifer was unresponsive and pronounced dead at age 29. It seemed like she just fell asleep and never woke up. After this, Jennifer began speaking and interacting with the world as if she had her whole life. Wait, what? What the heck? So you're saying like the twin was holding the other one back or like was like, I don't know, was manipulated. I, I don't know, that's crazy. It's literally an evil twin. No, mm -hmm. God, not please, today, no. Satan. And girl, why are your eyes half closed? <laughs> what the heck? We screenshotted you and you look ridiculous. This is footage of an actual demonic possession in 1896. There were no cameras up in 1896. How are you getting video? Nice try, you ain't gonna get me like that. That is terrifying though. She, it, how's it climbing? Dang, Spider-Man. Climbing with one arm and holding somebody and then you're just gonna drop him from the top rope. What in the WWE? is going on up in here <gasps> home or question mark you better go home use the blue one blue pill or the red pill ah oh no please tell me this actually takes us home 
Oh, that sucks. So you're screwed. You definitely should have gone with the question mark, my boy. You'll get home, you just need a parachute. Dang, that sucks, man. I mean, didn't you always want to go skydiving? So so there you go, man. You skydiving just from the dang from space. Wow, man, you you're screwed, man. Hopefully or or take off your pants, take off your clothes and use those as a parachute. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh heck no. What the I bet you I'd oh, what the shoot her in the foot. Should we keep going? Stop rando nodding. What the f Oh my god, is she following us? Yes. Oh, she's so quick. She was right there, man. And y'all were never seen again. That is terrifying. Look at the flick of the look out. Whoo, girl. I wish. I wish if you run up on me, girl, you getting clocked in the jaw. One quick left uppercut to the chin. A back, back. I don't even care if it's just like somebody who's like, oh, I'm just kidding, it's a prank. You're getting clocked. You're getting clocked across the face. You're getting knocked out. And then guess what? I ain't even gonna call an ambulance. Ambulance. A -ambul I, I ain't gonna call anybody to help you. This is what angels actually look like. And this is what a bad haircut looks like. Uh, I'm kidding. Yeah, I'm just, yeah, your hair's cool. All right. Okay, so we all thought that angels were just humans with wings. Yes. But that couldn't be farther from the truth. If we went by how the Bible described angels, they wouldn't look anything like this, but instead look terrifying and extremely weird. Let me show you. <gasps> oh, wow. Mmm. Yeah, that's, that's terrifying. Just because we're not used to it. Jeez. Or like that? What the heck? How many eyes does it have? Jeez. It's got one big eye and then a thousand other eyes. Okay. Imagine like you're just standing there and you see that thing. Mm -mm, man, you, you, be, you be freaking out. You'll be freaking out, man. Worst phobia to have. Entomophobia, fear of insects. I mean, I think everybody has that phobia. What kind of beetle is that? Dang, beetle juice. Ugh. That's too many ladybugs, my boy. Oh, those leaf bugs are. Ugh, ugh. Demon caterpillars on your counter. Oh my god, what kind of moth is that? What is coming out of your butt? What is that back there? Is that a stinger? Like, some somebody let me know, please. I'm asking for a friend. I guarantee you, I get the machete and I chop that thing in half. Spray it with raid. Black man. Oh wait, no, he's just wearing a costume all right well <clears throat> excuse me ding dong ditch really how'd you just cut the lights out like that honestly when i hear knocks at my door i don't answer it if it's important they'll leave a note <laughs> heck no man not today you really gonna look out in the hallway and be like oh who knocked man mm -mm. Man, stay your butt inside. Don't answer the door unless it's the pizza man. And don't forget to give him a tip. Here's a tip. Get a better job. Okay, I'm done. Watch this video at night. Why not? Back in 2015, a man was taking care of his friend's uncle who had dementia. On the first night, he made dinner and called him over to eat, but he didn't hear him say anything. He went to his room to check on him, but the door was locked. He said dinner's ready, but his response was a grunt. He didn't think anything of it, so he walked upstairs to go and sleep in the guest room. On the second night, he made dinner again, so he went to get his friend's uncle. He walked to his room, but this time the door was wide open and he wasn't inside. He didn't really think anything of it, so he just walked upstairs to go to sleep. He turned the lights off, got into bed, and that's when he heard a noise coming from the closet. He quickly stood <gasps> up, and that's when he screamed in horror. Like for part two. Are you serious, man? You uh, get it done in one part, man. What is up with y'all and cliffhangers? Like, like, just tell me everything that happens. I'm just gonna guess that uh, Jeff the Killer came out and uh, attacked everybody, and then the dude done threw a grenade and blew everybody up. Uh, the end. Uh, <clears throat> good night. Scary things hidden in photos. Okay. Like what? <gasps> just two people, right? Yep. Ah, this dude again, bro. You're just you're everywhere. Just a family. Are you serious? You gonna have to add the black man. In the, in the top corner. Wow, y'all look so happy. You cannot trust people that are that happy. Ain't nobody that dang happy. Y'all up to something. I know what y'all did. Y'all forgot to season the chicken. Don't ever try this. You can remember who you were in a past life by drawing this symbol on a piece of paper. Now get a mirror that you can stand in front of. Grab the paper in your left hand and look at yourself in the mirror. Then say, this is me now, show me then. If done correctly, you'll have a huge flood of memories coming in. But not every past life is good and something that should be seen. What? Man, you can't say, don't, don't ever, ever try, try this, this, and then expect me not to try it, man. Where's the mirror? Videos captured on Ring doorbell cameras, part one.
In this chilling video posted by a homeowner to the internet, a woman is seen walking up to the door. When a car passes by, she seems to act normal, but then she opens her mouth and extends her head towards the camera in the creepiest manner. Just check this clip out for yourself. <clears throat> Ugh. Girl, I swear, I will electrocute you. Uh, no thanks. It's these dang Jehovah's Witnesses. What would you do if you saw this on your home's ring camera? What would I do? Um, I'd pepper spray her right in the mouth. I would unleash a hive of bees right in her face. I'd spray cologne in her eyes. Yeah. I got a few old dolls. One tries to kill me. Well, get rid of it. You ended up in the hospital because she's sucking the life out of me. Well, girl, throw the doll away. Throw it in the trash. Give it to somebody else. Um, you're just gonna put it in a case. Don't just put it in a case, you dumb butt. Put it in the gulag. Anyway, but if you enjoyed this video, then go ahead, give it a like. And yeah, I'm Sia in the next one.